Hello guys, welcome to the session. We'll discuss about Azure storage accounts today. There are a variety of storage accounts that are available in Azure. Uh, let us go through each and every one and what is the meaning of that and why it is used. Initially, we look into uh, LRS, which is, we call it as a local redundant storage local redundant storage is nothing but it stores three copies of your storage in the data center region that you have selected but it is local to that particular data center only it will not replicate to any other data center when you choose this local redundant storage uh, when we choose an option to create ZRS, which is a zone redundant storage, it stores three copies of your storage in multiple data centers, but in the same region. So I'll, I'll explain you once again this one. It stores three copies of your storage in multiple data centers, but in the same region. In the re in one region, there might be a multiple data centers or number of data centers. We can we do not know that the number of data centers that are available in the region. And as you know that there are uh, data center regions that are available in India as well. Uh, one is Central India, South India, and West India, Pune, Mumbai, and Chennai. And when we create a, a India, a Central India uh, zone and in storage, which is available for a few customers, for a few Indian customers with enterprise agreement subscriptions, and um, those options you can see and if you select Central India, it will be as Pune. West India, it is Mumbai. South India, it is Chennai. So those are three data centers that are available in Indian data center regions. And uh, let us see the one more option of the storage account, which is a GRS, which is a geo redundant storage. It means that it stores three copies of your stories in primary region and the other three copies will be stored in the other region which we call it as secondary region. Why? Because if some anything goes wrong with the primary region data centers, still we have the data available in the uh, secondary region. By default, these regions are pre predefined. If we select the storage account to be configured in Southeast Asia, and by default, the secondary region will be East Asia. And these are the copies that are predefined by Microsoft Azure and in such a way that it syncs and copy to various uh, types as per the uh, storage type. And what we are discussing are all storage standard accounts. And there is one more uh, storage account in, under the standard group, which is REAGRS read access zero redundant storage when you choose this option it also uh, stores three copies three plus three one is in primary and, uh, and the other is in secondary here uh, the name itself indicates read access zero redundant storage saying that when the primary reason goes down, still the data is available 
instantly for read only access in the secondary region but this is not the case in geo and storage where it will take some time to get access of that data in from the secondary region that is the key difference for these RA GRS and Geo GRS. Most of the organizations are going through the GRS because of the wide variety of options and that are available here. It stores three copies in primary region and other three copies in secondary region. As I said, the example Southeast Asia, the second region will be East Asia. East Asia and for each and every reason the data center primary and secondary reasons are predefined if you select East Asia and the secondary reason will be Southeast Asia and vice versa so uh, this is the way that it goes and we can configure various types of standard storage accounts using version 1 portal and version 2 portal as well whereas in version 1 we are link linking these storage accounts to a cloud service but in version 2 we are linking these storage accounts to a resource groups and there is one more storage account which was recently introduced uh, which is premium storage account premium storage account whereas under this premium we have only PLRS premium local redundant storage the meaning itself indicates the premium the cost of this storage account is very high when compared to standard storage accounts why because the read rate operations for this premium storage is very high compared to standard and the hardware which is used at the back end of data centers are also very rich in uh, storage level and read rate level thank you for watching this session thank you very much